today and today we're going to have a game of winter games on the Atari 2600 yes now I never knew this come out on the Atari 2600 apparently so 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 we're going to give it a go of course now I originally played this on the Commodore 64 add it on the abstract CPC 464 played it I've reviewed it on a few systems actually now I wouldn't expect to see this on the Atari 2600 but we're going to give it a go UK really should be Great Britain but there you go um, I'm not going to hold anything against it but it should have been Great Britain not UK right oh right right there's no right we go straight to the game Okay, so they've gone a bit different here. There was no skin in the other versions. Obviously, I'm expecting this to be completely cut down, of course, because of the limitations of the console. But we'll give it a we'll give it a fair try. You know, I mean, looking at this vent, looks okay. So it's slalom skin. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, come on. So you get a penalty every time you hit a flag. Obviously, you're going to get a penalty when you miss them. Oh, what? Oh, for fuck's sake. So I've missed a flag there, so I'm gonna, that's going to be counted as a penalty. Oh, fucking hell. Right, here we go. Yeah, so here's my penalty. So, 1 minute 40.3. Oh, so the bobsleigh is different. So, right, how do we... Yeah. So, there, it did have a bobsleigh on the other versions, but... You're in chase view. This is look look down view. So okay. Not a lot of sound effects going on here. So that's probably the halfway point. Oh, you don't want to tip it, you don't want to tip it. Oh, so very bendy this course. And I've done it. One minute, two. Point five. You can. Am I getting gold or what? Ski jump. Oh, oh my god. Full, right, okay. Right, okay, now I'm supposed to push fire when it gets here. Oh, 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 Now this has this on, on the other versions as well. Here we come, oh my god. So if you get three attempts at this, so push fire to go. Make sure you don't push fire again until you get to the slope. Push fire here. Oh, oh shit! <laughs> I think I know what I'm doing wrong. It's slightly different to the computer versions this one but it's still what's that oh no this is biathlon now what do you do here now this looks completely different to oh 
obviously I don't know what you're supposed to be doing here. Left and right. Certainly not up and down, so it's left and right. Ah! Up, right. So this is sit same as the... Um, so it's down and up. Oh my, no, now I'm going up. Right, what am I supposed to be doing here then? It's not left, it is. But how do you steer? Or turn rather. All oh, right, I see what's going on. Well, yeah, when you shoot, it's the same as the computer versions. Right, I see what's happening now. All you got to do is... All you do here is left and right, and he moves. He skates. You don't control him. It controls by itself. Which makes perfect sense because that's what you did in um, the other versions. You didn't control where he goes. You just controlled him, you know, his, his motion. Makes perfect sense. Actually, I preferred this by Athlon and the other one because it just took too long on the computer on the computer systems what's this skate is this figure skating or free skate oh speed skating right this is similar so it's left and right motion so this is similar to the, um, the micro computer versions so it's pretty much here Obviously, as I expect, I'm going to expect it's going to be cut down. But what we got here is winter games. So, oh fucking hell, talking away there. I thought I finished. Come on. 125, come on. God, this time is shit. Come on. Yay, finally. I mean, the computer's just a computer pacer, but... I wasn't expecting a computer baser, but we've got that on here, which is good. But I'm not, it's not telling me what if I'm getting any medals or not. Hot dog. Now, this is usually the first event on the home computer versions. Yes, 3.6. That's not bad. I'll ignore that. Oh, fell flat on my ass. Fault. Right, you get three attempts at this. Oh, 3.8. Lug. What the fuck's this? Now, we don't have this event on the 8-bit version, it was just bobsleigh. So it's obviously a single man bobsleigh. Oh! Oh! Fuck! Fault. Oh, I didn't do no go Oh, get another go. I think fire axe is a break actually. So when the meters go out, that means the progress. It's your progress, right? Oh, I've 
done it again! Ah, oh, shit. So one more go. Be interesting to see what else, wonderfully, any of the other games come out on this. That I'm gonna look into that. Oh, oh I've done it again! Oh, fuck's sake! Oh, that looks sounds like it's the end of the game. Yep, that's the end of the game. Okay, I was expecting it to be cut down, but we got some extra events there. You know, obviously a replacement of some of the other events on the home ver on the home computer versions. But I'm not gonna I'm not gonna take anything away from this because it was rather playable. I actually I actually prefer the Biathlon on the Atari Twenty Six Hundred version than. The home computer versions, the home micro computer versions, because the home micro compute. That I say that again. The home micro computer versions of the Biathlon just took too long, but this didn't. This took well less than half the time, and it was actually more enjoyable once you figured it out. Um, the shooting's exactly the same, but I like the other events. Well, obviously, there were some that we got on the home versions. And I'm glad we didn't have the figure skating. We didn't get that on there because I didn't like the figure skating and the free skating. So, if you haven't played Winter Games on the Atari 2600, I would highly recommend it. If you like the Commodore 64 version, um, then give this version a go. It is definitely worth the go. Definitely. I would highly recommend it. Anyway, I'm going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time, and goodbye.